An inspiring drive after a spectacular day. Alan here. Can we talk? This post is located at rvacrossamerica.net forward slash Montana Journey. The post itself, the written post, is primarily a wrap-up of my time in Anaconda, Montana. A promise to you of more posts to come about that region, which I have now left, uh, coming up over the coming weeks, and a preview of new experiences to come, some of which have already started. This video was inspired at the end of an amazing day in Boulder, Wyoming. You're driving through downtown Boulder right now in the video. Uh, Boulder's a town of 1,200 people, small town, and uh, I was on my way <clears throat> to Anaconda, and the video includes some of that footage and just a bit more. It was shot uh, just before and during sunset, and uh, there's a lot of spectacular video. That's why I put this together. Uh, allow me to share some of the highlights you'll see over the next several minutes, and then I'm going to turn over the audio to some on-the-road music. Sound good? I will highlight a few things on screen by text as I encounter them. So if you're watching the screen, you'll see a few things flash up that uh, you might want to say, hey, that's a thing worth noting. Anyway, uh, here's what to look for. As this takes place before sunset, enjoy the Montana skies. And as I said, initially I drove through the small town of Boulder coming away from the Boulder Rodeo, which itself is a phenomenal experience, a really patriotic experience. And I'll clarify more about that when I do a write-up on a couple of uh, rodeos that I went to uh, just within the last few weeks. Um, when we turned onto I-15, you'll notice here there are S-curves, there's canyons, it is lightly traveled. This stretch between Butte and Helena is probably the least traveled interstate highway that I have um, run through. We'll be crossing the Continental Divide. You'll cross it with me. You'll see a marker on the screen when we are crossing it, and there's a marker on the roadway to show you the elevation that we're at as we cross the Continental Divide. And just after we do that, Butte is going to be just to the west. I mean just to the west. And that means it'll be on the right side of the screen. We'll be heading south on I-15 until we hit I-90. And we turn west on 90, which is really a north-south road in that immediate stretch. And it brings you up to Anaconda. The sunset itself pretty much occurs while I'm on I-90. And uh, also, you'll see when we get onto I-90, you'll begin to see smoke from the regional fires filtering back in. It's been pretty smoky second half of the summer. There's also footage in this video. The next morning, which is a Saturday morning, I was on my way to the Butte Farmer's Market, and it was smoky, so I decided to include a little bit of video footage from that. As a closing thought before I turn back to um, music, or turn over to music, I want you to enjoy this. I am Alan from rvacrossamerica.net forward slash Montana Journey. That'll bring you to the post. And again, there's a lot more on that post. It doesn't simply rehash the video. So I welcome you to read it. I'd love to hear your thoughts. There is a section down at the bottom where you can um, put your thoughts in. And on this video itself, I would really welcome a like, a subscribe, and comments. It does help the algorithm to get more people to uh, be exposed to this footage, and hopefully uh, they'll find it to be as inspiring as you did. Anyway, have a great morning, afternoon, or evening whenever you're seeing this. Now some tunes.